use of mesalamine granules results in low risk of relapse and side effects in patients who achieved corticosteroid-induced ulcerative colitis remission. Ulcerative colitis is an inflammatory bowel disease. The patients who used corticosteroids had a remission period of disease. Certain medications such as mesalamine granules reduce the risk of relapses. The alternative treatment that limits steroid exposure and ulcerative colitis relapses were beneficial in avoiding the corticosteroid remission. The patients who were diagnosed with ulcerative colitis were administered 1.5 grams of mesalamine granules once daily to evaluate the safety and efficacy of the drug in preventing the remission. This was a double-blinded study in which both the study groups were unaware of the drug being given. The OLE was a 24-month study. Male patients, non-pregnant and non-lactating females patients, more than 18 years of age diagnosed with mild-moderate ulcerative colitis. The study results may be affected when the patients with immunosuppressive drugs were taken. Therefore patients who were on four oral or rectal doses of corticosteroids were excluded from the study. The patients were taken from three multicentric studies, two studies were of six months period. The third study group was a 24 months open label trail. In double blinded trial, the study group was administered with 2S21 ration of MG and a marching placebo. The patients were unblinded, that means the patients were aware of the drug being administered. They received 1.5 grams of MG once daily. The six-month treatment phase of the double-blind, randomized trials consisted of four clinic visits. To assess disease activity and monitor adverse events, at baseline and months 1, 3, and 6. The 24-month open-label extension trial consisted of clinic visits to monitor adverse effects at baseline months 1, 3, and 6, and then every 3 months for up to 24 months. The treatment groups were compared for the primary endpoint by the use of cochrane mantle hinzel test. Cox proportional hazards regression model was used to assess differences between treatment groups, a hazard ratio. There were total 158 patients who were on corticosteroids out of which 105 patients were on mesalamine granules and 53 were on placebo. 77.10% of patients who were on mesalamine granules were relapse-free, and 54.7% of patients who were on placebo were relapse-free. When compared with the patients who were on placebo, 79.4% of the patients had no ulcerative colitis related adverse effects. There was a 49.2% of reduction in the risk of ulcerative colitis related adverse effects versus placebo. There was a relapse-free phase for six months in the 74 patients who continued mesalamine granule administration. There was also a significant that is 49.2% reduction in risk of ulcerative colitis related adverse effects. It was concluded that mesalamine granules, 1.5 grams once daily maintained the corticosteroid induced remission and the patients also had a low risk of relapse and ulcerative colitis related adverse effects.